hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you for stopping by it's so good to have you here please if this is your first time uh, consider subscribing to my channel um, so I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys what I'm trying to do here I'm trying to use uh, acrylic paint and epoxy to make a canvas an art canvas for my brother as a birthday gift so I already chose the colors that I want to use in this art and I have just gone ahead to place the colors down in the order that I want them to be. And then I'm going to use my paint brush to spread this color all around uh, the canvas. And then I'm going to add um, more paints and continue spreading until I get the desired results that I uh, want.
so now that I love the way it looks I'm going to go ahead and uh, place down a message uh, with little letters and a word that I got from Walmart I'm just gonna place that place that down on the canvas but before I do that I'm gonna use this white acrylic paint to and my toothbrush to spread around on the canvas to kind of give it a feeling of uh, the galaxy so I want the little paints to feel like stars in the sky or stars in the galaxy uh, and then the big droplets that form the canvas by mistake I'm just going to use my little paint brush and change those into big, uh, medium and small stars Now that I have all my words placed down the way I want them to be, I'm going to mix uh, my epoxy and put in a little bit of black glitter in it and then I'm going to spread it all over the canvas. Now one thing that I noticed is that while I was spreading my epoxy on the canvas, the letters started to move. I didn't uh, expect that to happen with the canvas, I have never tried this before, this is the first time. But I have seen this happen before on a picture frame. But so as I realized that they started to move, I just uh, decided to wait until the epoxy was a little bit tacky and then uh, use a little picker to push the letters back into the positions that I want them to be. So I did that about two times and then uh, the epoxy got really tacky and was almost starting to solidify already and the letters stopped moving.
after placing down um, some little stars that I got from Walmart and using my picker to push the letters back into place, I used my torch to torch down the epoxy to make sure that I took out every bubble that was in the epoxy. I left this to dry overnight, 24 hours, and after drying overnight, this is how it looks like. I really enjoyed the way this turned out. If you guys enjoy watching my video, if you love the way this turned out, please give this a thumbs up and please subscribe and please stay tuned for more videos to come. Thank you. Bye-bye.